huge. You know, that when people talk about all the changes I made from 18 to 19 and becoming a successful pitcher, uh, they like to talk about changing my arm action and, and this and that. But the by far the number one most important thing I did was fix what was going on, on up there. Um, you know, I was pitching in 18 with a lot of anxiety. I put a lot of pressure on myself. Um, you know, I'd have starts where I'd like walk the first batter of the game, give up a hit, and then I feel like the, the walls are caving in around me. And that's not something that should ever happen. You know, when you're out there and, and you have the ball – and you're pitching in a, in a big league baseball game, like you have to have all the confidence in the world if you're going to get through it. And then you have to go and do it, you know, a few days later over and over. So that was the like most important thing that I had to make sure I got, I got right going to the next season. Um, I love Allen stuff. I've been doing Allen stuff since I, since I was a kid, um, the breathing yoga, um, meditation. It's all wonderful. Uh, a big thing, uh, another big thing is visualization. I think visualization is hugely important. I do it in a number of different ways. Uh, I've done it through the neurofeedback training program I'm involved in, uh, which, you know, I, I started that before the 19 season. I still do that stuff. Um, uh, visualization, like as I do scouting reports, uh, interesting way I do that is playing MLB The Show. Uh, play MLB The Show as myself, pitching against the team I will be pitching against in real life the next day, doing my scouting report, you know, taking my notes, um, applying that scouting report to the video game, and then seeing my video game self being successful uh, the day before I go and pitch in a game. You know, it sounds kind of weird, and it's definitely nerdy.